Man, what up, YouTube? It's your boy, ProTech Sports. Breaking FN news. Boy, if the Kansas City Chiefs offense wasn't unstoppable before, it might be unstoppable now, bro. Oh, my gosh. The Chiefs just got Le'Veon Bell, bro. One-year deal. Probably sent him the laden deal. Um, so now you mean to tell me um, this Le'Veon Bell signing? I know he's come off come off a, a Jets tenure where he has an average more than eighty seven yards in any given game as a Jet. Um, no one hundred yard games, nothing like that. Injuries all over the place. He took a year off after Pittsburgh wanted to give another franchise tag. Um, Adam Gates never wanted Le'Veon in New York, so. He got a little misused. Le'Veon gained a little weight. Uh, I think he shed that way off now, though. So I think he's fine now. But he got a little, got a little chubby over there. Um, so, yeah, uh, he got fell off the money. And then the Jets got rid of him. So, um, now he's in Kansas City. Quick opinions on this. The Chiefs' offense is now officially unstoppable. It's, it's over. It's unstoppable now. It's literally... Bro, you mean to tell me that it's Patrick Mahomes, Clyde Edwards Elair, Le'Veon Bell, Tyreek Hill, Sammy Watkins, Travis Kelsey. Who is stopping this offense? Who? Who bro, the only thing I would say the Chiefs don't have is a secondary tight end outside Travis Kelsey. That's what I mean they don't have. They, they had a tight end. Who can beat one on one coverage outside of Travis Kelsey? This offense would be beyond unstoppable. But the fact that they had, and Demarcus Robinson's another guy they like, Miko Harmon, this offense is officially unstoppable, bro. Because now, if you if you bring the light box, they'll run Le'Veon and Kyle Edwards, you live 30 times a game, and just beat you up that way. And the moment you suck up and put eight men in the box, they going to play action fake, and they're going to they going to reek. They're going to be cold deep. They're going to Sammy Watkins deep. They're hitting seam routes to, to, uh, to Travis Kelsey. And, oh, by the way, if you want to play eight men in coverage and they have a running back in the backfield, you know what they can do now? They can hang off on the draw. You only got three people in the box now. You got three, you got three people in the box, eight, you got eight people in coverage. They'll gain eight, nine yards on a draw. Then it's second and one. And it, it, you can, it, it'll go into an eye formation or a single back formation and with two two receivers in the route. Go play action fake. Hit reek deep. Bow! You know what I'm saying? They can spread you out. Light you up that way. They can do everything now. They're unstoppable, bro. Offense is literally unstoppable now, bro. Comments and thoughts on this Le'Veon Bell signing, bro. I think this signing tips it in the Chiefs' favor for sure. Especially in the AFC. Um, Pittsburgh... They might be the only team that can maybe lock down the, the Chiefs for four quarters. Um, the, the Patriots did a good job. Don't get me wrong. The Patriots did a really good job against the Chiefs offense. But they ain't no offense to stay themselves when they play the Chiefs. The Steelers, on the other hand, they got it, it can sustain some offense. Now with Cam coming back, the only two teams I think that could take this Chiefs team on is... Pats, Steelers. That's it. There's only two teams I think can take the Chiefs. Any other team in the AFC, I, 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 know, I know Tennessee's 4-0. Um, but they, they can't handle this offense, man. They can't handle this offense, bro. They just can't. This is a different animal, bro. Uh, the Bills, this a, is a, a, a different animal, bro. I might even going to hold you. I might even try to be funny. They allowed 42 to uh, Tennessee the other night, bro. You know what Kansas City going to do to you? <laughs> oh, my God. God, this defense, I mean, this offense is insane. They add Le'Veon Bell to this offense. Bro, this is crazy, man. This is crazy. You comment your thoughts. Let me know about Le'Veon Bell to Kansas City. Do you like the move? Do you love the move? Do you hate the move? I love this move for Kansas City. I love this move for Le'Veon. I think Le'Veon will probably get about 10, 15 touches a week. I don't think he's going to upsert Clyde edwards Lair, in my opinion. So the fact that he has chemistry with Patrick Mahomes, he has chemistry with his team, they drafted this kid. So I think he's going to still get the majority of the touches. But 
those those, those touches Darwin Thompson was getting and uh, D- uh not not not, not Damian Williams, but Daryl Williams was getting. Man, scrap that. Th- those are Le'Veon's touches now. He'll probably get about 10, 15 touches a week. I think he's going to be very effective. So, Comment your thoughts, man. Let me know about, about, about the Le'Veon Bell move, man. Like, comment, subscribe, and share if you're a new man, Tom. Post notifications. Hit that notification bell for your boy, Tom, at Protest Sportsman. Put God first to the save this COVID-19. All remember the most athletic Italian sport choice as long as you are professional and technically sound and finally sound. You will always overcome the lack of time. Listen for hard work and dedication, man. Protest fans, I'm like always. Have a great one, man. Love y'all. Take it easy, bro. Let me know about this Le'Veon Bell thing, man. I think officially the Kansas City offense is now unstoppable, bro. I'm not even going to cap to you, bro. I think this offense is officially unstoppable. Let me know what you think. Take it easy, guys. Peace.